Hello friends, this video on surface area and volumes part 12 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. The length of the troplane, what length of troplane 3 meter wide is a troplane that is 3 meter wide will be required and there has to be some length, we don't know. Okay. To make a tent of height 8 meter and radius as 6 meter. Assuming that the extra length of the material that will be required for stretching margins in the wastage in cutting is approximately 20 centimeter. So they are planning to make a tent and they are saying that uh, some 20 meter wastage will be there, 20 centimeter wastage will be there. Okay, so we have to find the length of the material required. Right, so this 20 centimeter is 20 centimeter. This one is extra. This is the waste. 20 centimeter of this cloth will be waste. So that is something which we can take a little. So first, let's find the surface area of this particular cone or particular canonical conical tent right so if we can find the surface area of this conical tent that will give me the length of cloth required minus the wastage okay so let's find curve surface area of tent and that is nothing but pi r l we know R, we don't know L, so we can just find L root of R square plus H square. The values R is what? 6 square. H is what? 8 square. 64 plus 36 is 100. 100 root is 10. So it is 10. 10 meter. So put the value. Pi is 22 by 7. R. R is 6 and L we just found to be 10. This will be meter square. Okay, so approximately when you can put 22 by 7 or you can put 3.14 also if you want. So it will be 188.4 meters square. That will be the total curved surface area of this particular tent. So what is the length of cloth required without margin, without wastage, sorry, that will be nothing but area of the, or let me say, area of cloth will be equal to area of curved surface area of 10. So what is the area of cloth, length to breadth, so this value of length into breadth that is 3 meter, is it 3 meter, let me check, yeah, 3 meter and that is area of the tent. So with this, the length comes out to be 188.4 by 3 meter and that is nothing but 62.8 meter. That is the length of the cloth required plus point meter this is 0.20 centimeter I can directly convert into 0.2 meter to make sure all the units are in meter 0.2 meter is wastage right so wastage is 0.2 meter so total is what 62.8 plus 0.2 that is 63 meter 63 meter of the cloth will be required to make this tent okay Pretty easy question. Slant height and the base diameter of a conical tom is given. So this slant height is this value. Okay. And the base diameter 14. So I'll make it to a radius. So I'll just convert this to a radius. That is 7 meter. Right. This is a conical tom whose slant height and radius is given. We need to find the cost of whitewashing its curved surface area. 
so curved surface area of cone is nothing but pi r l both the values are given 22 by 7 is pi r is 7 l is 25 it will be in meter square so it becomes 550 meters okay we have to find the cost of white washing so 100 meter square cost is what 210 so 550 meter square cost will be what 210 by 100 into 550 you solve it you get rupees 1155 and that is the answer okay a joker's cap is in the form of right circular cone you see this cap it looks like a cone okay with the base radius of 7 this radius is 7 height is 24 find the area of the sheet required to make 10 such cap and if you see in the cap the base is hollow right we have to find the curved surface area here so we have to find the curved surface area nothing but pi or l so we know r we don't know l so let's find the value of l L is root R square plus L square from the value root of 7 square plus 24 square is nothing but root uh, 625 and that is nothing but 25 and the unit will be 74. So let's put the value pi R L 22 by 7, R is 7 and L is 25. This is centimeter square. You solve it, you get 550 centimeter square is a curved surface area. How many, uh, what is the area of the sheet required to make 10 such cap? So one cap, one cap implies 550 centimeter square. So 10 cap will need what? 550 into 10, that is 5500 centimeter square. Pretty easy question. A bus stop is barricaded from the remaining part of the road by using 50 hollow cones you must have seen this kind of barricades used to control the traffic right made of recycled cardboards or this is made of cardboard but typically you see what is made of uh, typically you see the cones they are made of plastics each cone has a base diameter of 40 centimeter right so that means each i'll make it as a half that is 20 because they always take radius this is the radius is 20 centimeter and the height is 1 meter. So let me take one such cone, this one. This is 20 and this is 1. So if you see this is in meter, this is in centimeter and the cost of painting is in meter square. So let me convert this into meter only. It becomes 0.4 meter. So it becomes 0.4 meter. So what I'll take is, let me take this now, 0.2 meter, right? That is the radius and 1 meter is the height, okay, per barricade. So the outer side of the each of the cone is to be painted here and the cost of painting is given. We have to find the cost of painting of all the cones. So first we have to find what curved surface area because they are hollow cones, right? There is no base. We don't have to paint the base. First, we have to find the curved surface area of the cone. Then, we have to find the cost of painting of that cone. Once we find the cost of painting of one cone, we have to find the cost of painting of 50 cones. Okay, so let's try start with this curved surface area of cone is pi r l. L is not given, so let's find the value of l. L is root R square plus H square. That is nothing but this is 0 0.2. So 0 0.2 square plus 1 square. And right? this becomes 0 0.04 0 .04 plus 1. So this becomes 1.04. Approximately, if you take a root, this becomes 1.02. Let's put the value pi R L 3.14. R is 0 0.2. L is 1.02. Why I took 3.14? Because 
there is no number which is dividing 7 okay so if you and this will be meter square okay so you solve this what you get is 0 0.64056 meter square that is the surface area of one cone so we have 50 cones right so curved surface area of one cone is this so 50 cone will be what 50 into this value okay so that will come out to be 32.028 meters square so we have we have got the curved surface area of all the cones now we can find the cost right so 1 meter square is equal to 12 so this many meter square will be what so 1 meter square cost is equal to 12 rupees this many meter square that is 32.028 meter square will be what 12 into 32.028 and you solve this you get 384.34 rupees that is the answer okay thank you visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality education videos you can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website. You can also get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website. Thanks a lot for watching.